Um, feel like you guys, you know, started off fairly. I mean, you were you started off one down, but you came back at that point. You know, what was the feeling on the field? Uh, I think today was a bit of a weird game, to be honest. Um, I don't think we didn't obviously play perform well at all, in my opinion. Um, I think our response to the goal was good, like you said, and to get back to one-one. And then I felt like we were on top for a while, but then we just didn't keep the ball well enough. We were we were forcing long balls. You know, with two of their best players out today, in my opinion, I felt like we should have dominated possession and, you know, played the kind of football that we know we're capable of, but we didn't. You know, we turned the ball over too easily. Um, we were too stretched. And, you know, three goals that we conceded were poor for our standards. So, overall, a really disappointing night. Um, and, yeah, we definitely didn't deserve to get anything out of the game. So, it's frustrating because a win, you know, really could have given us some hope to make playoffs but obviously that's looking slim now so you know now it's just about pride and trying to finish off the season you know as well as we possibly can which I'm sure we will. I mean it's interesting you say pride because mm -hmm. that is your next game coming yeah. up. I mean to what extent is roster rotation in your mind? I know you guys have injuries so mm -hmm. there's not a lot of people to rotate but you know how much is that on your mind going into this game? Yeah you know he's obviously looked to do that over the last few weeks um, the, the team hasn't been the same week in week out and you know sometimes that's not ideal either as a centre forward you know you want to be playing with the same players you want to be building partnerships and you know to be honest I probably haven't played with the, the same front three for more than two games in a row if that um, and it's the same for the back four at the minute I think the midfield's probably been the most consistent but just purely because we literally just have them three at the minute and um, so you know it's not ideal but you know we can't keep looking for excuses uh, you know it's it's easy to say that you know Houston could have said they had Carly Lloyd and you know, Brian out today, it was two of their best players, but they didn't, they've come here, they've put on a show and they've got the three points deservedly. So, you know, for us, we've just got to dig deep. Um, we're all professionals, we all know what it takes. We've been here before and, you know, we've just got to work hard and whoever's playing on that pitch needs to needs to turn up on Saturday because Orlando are flying. So if we play like we did today, it's not going to be a very pleasant game for anyone to watch. So we need to definitely regroup and get ourselves ready for Saturday. You returned to the starting 11 for this game. How did that feel? It was nice. You know, I've, I'm a player that wants to play. I want to start. Um, you know, for me, it was it was tough. You know, not to be in the starting 11. Um, you know, I've, everywhere I've gone, I've always played, and so it was definitely an eye opener. But you know, for me, it's it's been a lear learning curve, and you know, it's made me hungrier to play. Um, and it was great to get back into the team today and to start, and you know, to score as well, which is what I love doing. And you know, would have loved to have played longer, but you know, I understand that's the decision he he went. To, he obviously decided to make. But for me, I just want to win games. I want to play. I want to win. I want to help the team get as high up the table as they possibly can. So, whether that's me starting or coming off the bench, you know, I'll always give a hundred percent for this team. Do you want another fruit slice? Yes, please. <laughs> that's so good. <laughs>